I'm Judy Shaw for NYSE Floor Talk. Joining me today is John Payton. He is CEO at Dine Brands Global. Wonderful to see you, John. Welcome back to the NYC. Thank you. It's good to see you as well. So you're here today. You just had your earnings. Talk to me about that. Tell me what some of the highlights are. The, the highlights of our earnings call is that throughout 2022 and in the last quarter of Q4, uh, Americans and our guests are willing to spend on experiences. And while they might be dialing down on pillows for the couch or new drapes, they want to go out and see friends and family in restaurants and bars and, and hotels. And our brands were resilient during that time because Applebee's and IHOP and now Fuzzy's Taco Shop, which I'd love to talk about, mm -hmm. <laughs> is uh, they're all three are value oriented brands, you know, and have spent years um, building trust with their guests about that this is the place to come for value. Um, and we really thrive during that time. OK, so you mentioned the Fuzzy's acquisition. Tell me about the acquisition and why it's important. So you may not know it well because it's not here in New York, but it, it started in, it's, uh, in Texas and it's grown up out of into Colorado and um, uh, uh, Oklahoma. And it's a fantastic Mexican restaurant in the fast casual space, which we love because that's a high growth category, both fast casual and Mexican. They describe themselves, Judy, as having a sassy, badass attitude. Ooh. So we love the branding. <laughs> we love the big screen TVs. We love the Instagrammable drinks at their bar. Um, and the food is terrific. So we see it as a, as a real growth engine for, for us. And we're excited to add it as the third brand in our portfolio. OK, well, who doesn't love tacos, too? <laughs> That's right. So tell me, how are consumer dining habits shifting? You know, what we're seeing is that, like, like I mentioned when we started, is that their uh, consumers are still coming. You know, our guests are still coming to the restaurants. Our average check remained the same throughout 2022 in all four quarters. And in order to achieve that at a, at a time when prices are increasing, we do see our guests managing through our menu and finding the value oriented portions of our menu. So they'll, they'll do the two for the price of something um, or our limited, limited time offers and things like that. And so um, we're just thrilled that they're coming out to our restaurants and that they know us so well and that they're navigating through the menu in a way that makes sense for them. All right. Well, it's always wonderful to talk with you, John. Thanks for joining me on Floor Talk. You as well. Thank you. Yeah.